Hey, we got the Nightcore Concept 1 C1 in front of us here today. Gearbest sent me this, do a review and some beam shots of it. So that's what we're going to end up doing. Took this light out, run it through the ropes, and I'm quite impressed with this thing by Nightcore. They just keep getting better and better and better. Now this light has the Cree XHP35 HDE3 emitter in it. This thing blasts out to 1800 lumens of light output and it's incredible for such a small handheld flashlight run on one single 18650 battery. I really like the small form factor on it. This thing here, I mean you can put it in your back pocket and you almost don't know it's there. And you literally can take this thing out shining at night. We're going to run through the features it has and then we're going to get some good beam shots and test this bad boy out. To start it out with, it's got a power indicator. If you were to partially unscrew the tail cap and turn it on, you're going to see it blink. And from what I've seen, fully charged, four blinks, it's fully charged. And as you work down, less blinks. It has a side switch, what I thought was kind of weird, but the reason why that's there is so they can keep it at a small form factor overall. It's a unique metal side switch that's hinged and then it's got a screw in the end that holds it down. You basically just press it. It's got two selectable operating modes, general and tactical. And to get through them, you partially unscrew the tail cap and while holding the side switch down, screw the tail cap back on and it'll blink once for general and then blink twice for tactical and it's running five modes plus strobe has a magnetic tail cap very strong one from what I can see and it does have quick access to turbo and you get your typical accessories a lanyard spare o-rings a nice uh, holster and you got the Nightcore 60 month warranty which is an excellent warranty now as far as the modes the max runtime on this is 300 hours you're looking at when you turn it on you just basically press it and you're gonna go into low mode and that's one lumen for 300 hours like I said you got your quick access to turbo once it's on if you were to hit the switch you're going right into turbo I'll shut it off turn it back on you're gonna go through into low mode and then low uh, next mode up is 80 lumen for 15 hours Next mode up, 300 lumens for 4 hours. Next mode up, 810 lumens for 1.5 hours of runtime. Pretty wicked. Then you got your turbo, 1800 lumens for 30 minutes of runtime. Extremely bright for how small it is. And yeah, it does start getting a little bit warm on turbo mode at 1800 lumens. So what we're going to do, we're going to head out and test this light. Do some good beam shots of it. Probably go up against some car headlights and whatnot. Lux meter tests like I always do. See how this guy does. Like I said, check them links out down below for this from Gearbest. Run a lot of sales and I am now affiliate to them. So I'll probably be getting a lot more unique products from them. Put on and see how that goes. All right, we are four, we're four meters away from my house. I got this Nightcore Concept 1 on the lowest mode, and we are going to turn it to the brightness, shine it at the lux meter, and calculate the throw. See how far this will calculate the throw. That's the highest mode. Let's go see what it was. 632 lux coming out of that thing. They have four meters. We're going to times that by four meters squared, 16, and then divide by 0.25, brightness of the moon. And we're going to take the square root of 40,448. 201 meters I got out of that thing. Pretty nice. All right, here's the concept one. And I'm going to turn it on high. Right there at 62 meters away, that tree. Now we're going to move down. You're looking at 94 on that tree. But incredible job for this small light lighting this up. All the way back there is 130 meters on up to 190. And that one tree right there in the middle of the back, I think it's right around 140, maybe 130. 
But incredible job being done by this light. Pretty impressed with it. Look at that. Very usable light too. Nice spill and and flood. Now moving down a little bit with a concept. Looking at over a right around 190 meters, 180 right there. Pretty nice. Can't see anything behind it, but there is a hillside, but it is hitting out to them trees at about 180 meters. And we're gonna go through the modes on this concept. We'll start out in the lowest mode, which is right there. You can't really see it up closer. And there's the next mode up. It does a pretty good job, even up to 30 meters already. And next mode up, even farther, looking pretty good. Throws a lot of light out. Look at that. All the way back to 60 meters, no problem. So close range, this thing is just wicked. A lot of spill, a lot of light. And there's the highest mode, right there. Give you a good idea. Right in the middle, I'll redo it in my patio, and I haven't got it done yet. So pretty neat. All right, here's the concept up against some HID car headlights, and I got the lights on bright. They're very very bright lights but there's a concept on basically turbo mode it drowns them out quite well car headlights concept car headlights concept pretty awesome so there you are nightcore concept one wicked little light and i mean little it's uh one of the smallest lights that i've run across with this amount of, uh amount of output on it pretty unique features incredibly bright can't go wrong with this one. Pretty neat. So there you go. Nightcore Concept C1. Check them links out down below. Till the next time.